Let's take a look at my favorite vegan leather belt bags from this year. All right, you guys, I have five vegan leather belt bags that I wanna share with you that have been go-tos for me this year. Um, one that I've been loving for a long time is the Bowie Pack from Bodiment. This little bag is such an awesome size. It has a really good width to it where it's not too big, um, but gives you a nice good space on the inside. And you can wear it multiple ways, which I love. So you have the strap here that can attach to the D-rings on the side, or you can loop it through the leather pieces on the back here and wear it as like a fanny pack or as like a sling bag across your chest. And since it is removable, um, you can add some sort of fun woven strap to it, which is what I personally love to do. They have so many cute straps on their website, but on the inside here, you do have a zippered pocket and then you also have some card slots. Oh, and there is a little slip pocket here as well. And the inside is this kind of nice light tan color, so um, easy to see everything in there. And I just think it's a really cute style. I also love, love, love the Lily Jade Sleek Pack. Um, this particular one is actually in their leather material, but they do have it available in the vegan leather in multiple colors, which is so awesome. And I just love how this bag sits across your body. It's so nice and sleek and slim um, while still fitting a ton of stuff. This top pocket here can fit diapers and wipes definitely big enough to do that even though from the outside it doesn't look like that so it's a very deceiving kind of Mary Poppins bag this particular one does not have a removable strap, so the strap is stationary um, the strap that's on it is a nice nylon strap it has a plastic buckle this one is really fun because on their vegan leather ones it's a gold hardware kind of an elevated style so the sleek pack is on the list for sure now these last three kind of have a similar shape to them um, this one is the Amy Fanny Pack from Azaria. Nice kind of brass gold hardware. You do have a zipper on the back, which is great to put your phone into. And then just the main compartment has a zippered pocket in the back. Um, it's a light color interior that is wipeable. And I really like um, Azaria's vegan leather in particular. It just has such a cool look to it. It kind of looks marbled. Um, they also have a lot of fun colors to choose from on their website. The nylon strap that you get with this one is a little bit thinner, um, but still nice and comfortable and this bag is a really good width so you can fit a lot in here including like smaller water bottles can fit in here and it just fits very nicely across your chest it will stick out a little bit further than the other two that I just showed you like the sleek pack is something very slim to your body this is a little bit different of a shape so just something to consider when you are choosing a belt bag for yourself I usually would mind extra width coming off of my body but maybe because it gets slim here towards the base of the bag um, I find these bags to be comfortable on my body this particular style and I'm able to fit a lot in here. So that is the Amy from Azaria. And the Elkie is set up really similarly. You actually have a zippered pocket on the back just like you do on the Amy fanny pack. You do get a pocket here on the front though and you don't get that on the Azaria one. Um, it is a magnetic pocket which is nice. And then on the inside you do get a little more organization. Um, you have a zippered pocket in the back. You have a slip pocket here on the front and you also have a key leash on the inside. And this one has a really fun fabric that's also wipeable and cleanable. Um, and another thing that's different about this one is it does have a strap that can be removed on one side. So you can't remove it completely. It's attached and stationary on this side, um, but might be easier to put on and off that way um, instead of having to adjust it every time to like go around your waist or something. So I do like that they added that ability to unbuckle it. The vegan leather from Elkie & Co is a really beautiful um, microfiber vegan leather. It comes in multiple colors. And this strap actually is not just a nylon strap. It has nylon on one side and then it has the vegan leather on the other side. So it's a little bit thicker of a strap. Super cute, similar in size to that Amy Fanny pack. Really nice and smooth zippers. Um, I just like the quality of this and how it feels. It's a really nice fanny pack. And last but not least, we have the Poppy and Peony Sidekick. I think I need this in a couple more colors because I have been loving this bag. You can see here it has the similar shape to the Azaria and the Elkie bags, um, but this one is a little bit slimmer. It doesn't stick out as far and it's not as wide. So a little more minimal. I really like the vegan leather that Poppy and Peonies uses. It's so soft 
and it has held up for me really nicely. I love the zipper pull you have here on the front. Um, super cute with that gold hardware. This one also has the option to unclip it from one side and then on the other side it is attached to the bag. On the back you have a zippered pocket and my phone will fit in here just fine. And then super smooth zippers. On the inside you get a light pink interior with a zippered pocket on the back and some card slots to help you stay organized. And I just find that this size is perfect for all my stuff when I'm going out by myself. I have been grabbing for this a lot ever since I got it. So there you go, my top five favorite vegan leather belt bags for this year. I hope that was helpful and gave you some new bags to look at. Tomorrow's video is gonna be all about real leather bags. So if you're more into leather, stay tuned for that video. Check in tomorrow to see that review. But for now, I'm gonna let you guys go. I hope you have a wonderful day and I'll see you tomorrow.